Hello, my name is Matt Geiger, and I'm the proud new principal of Pope Farm Elementary School. Being a new school and a new principal in that school, I thought it would be important for me to do a video introduction so that you have some idea of who the new principal is and where we're going to go as a school. So without further ado, here is a little bit of information about myself and the school. I was born in Racine and grew up in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. I attended Dominican High School in Whitefish Bay and UW-Milwaukee for my undergrad and master's degree program. I also participated in a capstone certificate program here at the University of Wisconsin-Madison. I have been blissfully married for the past 20 years to Carrie Dwyer, who is an attorney here in Madison. My interests include traveling, theater, music, fishing, playing the guitar, and following the Packers and the Badgers, among other things. A little bit about my work history. I began my career in Racine as a special education teacher, teaching children in first through third grade. I later became a middle school assistant principal and then returned to the elementary school to be a principal in a K-4 through fifth grade school in Racine. To move a little closer to my home, I moved to Cudahy to be a principal. This is where my love for travel and learning about different cultures began to influence my career. I moved with my wife to Peru in South America and began a principal career in international schools. Internationally, I worked in Peru, the Galapagos Islands of Ecuador, and Mexico City, Mexico. I returned during the 2018 school year and began looking for my next position. The Madison Middleton area was a natural location as it has many outdoor activities, a community focused on conservation, an excellent education community, and of course, the Badgers. Why am I excited to be the principal of Pope Farm Elementary School? Well, first of all, the vision and the mission of the Middleton Cross Plains Area School District is directly aligned to my beliefs about education. I strive to model the type of school culture that I'll develop. You'll find me to be an inclusive, energetic, innovative, and actively involved school principal. Most of my time will be spent outside of my office, which will allow me to develop the authentic relationships with the children, the parents, the teachers, and the school community. I strive to know all the children by name, work directly with the teachers in the classrooms, and make myself readily accessible to parents. This approach creates a school environment that is open, caring, and high achieving. I am a collaborative principal. I work with the teachers directly as a member of the educational team. I enjoy learning best practices and methods in education so that our children are always challenged and engaged in the curriculum. I encourage the educational practices that take the children from where they are and then guide them through the rest of their learning to where we hope that they can achieve. I enjoy a focus on STEAM and STEM projects. I encourage the teachers to include as many disciplines as possible in their various projects to challenge the children and make the important connections to increase the level of retention of the essential skills that we're teaching. These essential skills are based on the Common Core curriculum. These types of projects keep children engaged and challenged. They allow for differentiation and accommodate the needs of all children in the school. Lastly, I am conservation-minded. My school once won an Energy Star Award for their focus on energy savings in the school. But beyond that, I will look to take advantage of our unique location next to the Pulp Farm Conservancy. The Conservancy will be a great source of community projects and real life learning. I believe that we have a lot to offer them and they us. It will be a real win-win situation for our school community. Well, it's been fun making this video and sharing my background and some educational ideas with you. If you have any questions about the educational programming or concerns about your child in school, I encourage you to stop by and have a chat with your child's teacher or me. Stay up to date with the school website for any current events or emergency information. Thank you for watching and I look forward to working with you this year. Together, we'll make a great school experience for your children.